Hey guys, it's Van Hart Dogs here, and today we got some briars in the mail, so it is unboxing time. So I'm very happy because I can relive my childhood now. Bubble wrap. <gasps> oh, <it is. laughs> can you can you see the briars? All right. Oh my goodness, guys. She is beautiful. Oh my gosh, those crisp markings. Her face, though. So freaking cute. Which one? Which one? This one. Oh my gosh. Look, this is Catch Me. Um, oh, it's, it's a boy. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> These were a bit of an impulse buy, so please don't be mad that I don't know much about these models. I see a little fleck under the finish, um, which is sad. I hate seeing flaws right away on a model. Besides that, I don't see anything else yet. So this is model number two. And who's this? It's Wynn, oh my gosh. Okay, first of all, she has the same name as the horse from Chronicles of Narnia, um, the horse and his boy. Um, is it Aravis' horse? <gasps> Her dapples are so cute. Oh, she's so pretty. And she has little leg barring on her legs. <sighs> she's so cute. And the real life horse is so pretty. I can like smell the new briar smell. Um, and I love that plasticky smell. I don't know if anyone else like knows what I'm talking about, but it is a real thing, okay? <laughs> All right, that was horse three of five. Oh, okay, I see Bisbee. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, she is way darker than the photos that I saw. Look at her. Bisbee is, I believe, a run of 3,000? She has this beautiful coppery pattern. Um, this is actually my first decorator. Not glossy, but she's actually kind of shiny. Like she's not matte. She reminds me of those uh, pottery creatures that like grandmas have in their house that are like that dark blue and like black color. I don't know if anyone knows what I'm talking about, but like her face and the shading on it reminds me of it so much. And the speckling that she has too. She is really cute. I was kind of nervous about ordering her. I wasn't sure if I would like a decorator, but she's got some attitude. She is flashy and I live for flashy horses. So that was the second last fourth rider. And then here we have Paint Me a Pepto. When this model first came out, I really wanted her. Paint Me a Pepto. Okay. Hello there. Oh, her face. Her markings are crisp. The horses I saw at the store were blurry, but her markings, I do not see a single flaw yet, um, which makes me nervous to unbox her. <laughs> Look at those hoovy hooves. She is so cute. Look at that face. It's her in real life. The little cow cow. So cute. Maybe I should move this. <laughs> Just a thought. Gosh. Now comes the poopy part of taking them out of their boxes. But I'm gonna keep her in her box for now because she appears to be mint and I just want to keep her collectability up for now. I'm probably gonna cave and unbox her eventually, but I would like to display some of my models still in their boxes, so we are going to leave her. But the regular ones I'm definitely taking out. I think Bisbee I'll keep in her box. Ooh, look, I ripped it. I'm getting kind of hot. I had my window open, but the wind was blowing, so... to close it because my blinds are making a ton of noise. I love his pink little muzzle. He has a little thingy right there. His facey face. Besides that, I don't see any 
anything wrong with him? Is this just dust? Yeah, that's just dust. Um, he's really cute. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I missed another one. Ta-da! Let's get this finger off this poor, poor horse. The dappling on this side is really subtle but beautiful. I really love the horseshoes. Um, they're cute. And this is the tail. I don't know what to say. <laughs> I feel so awkward. This is the mouth. The, the mouthy. You go kiss. Kisses. Briar kisses. From Catch Me. Catch Me says, I hope you have a great day. Besides the little speck under um, the finish on Catch Me's face, he's actually in really great condition and the paint is beautiful. So I'm just going to say he has a realistic, come on, focus. He has a realistic little, focus, little wart. He has a realistic little wart and that makes him even more accurate, okay? Okay. I love you. You're so cute. I'm going to put Catch Me away and we are going to open up our next model, Quinn. Oh, it ripped. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, it ripped again. Nothing works, guys. Love that. Da, 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 da. Oh, hello. Look at those dapples. I like her little freeze brand. She has such a pretty forelock and mane and tail. These are her feet. I feel like I would like her if she had some sort of facial marking a little bit more. Maybe like a stripe or something, just because her face looks a little plain. But I love her dappling and her pose is really cute. Very nice gray. So, yeah. That's her. This is Quinn. Quinn says hello. Boop. Okay. Da -da -da -da. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. Look. Look. Look at that face. Look at that face. Look at those crisp markings. Look at those gorgeous, glorious feeties. Look at that whooshy whooshy tail. Look at that hold a horse. Oh, yes, I mean, she's a paint horse, but you get the idea. Yes, she has been freed from the evil wiry clutches of her box. Oh, there's another piece of wire. Guess you're never free. She has this super cute little white speck on her butt. She looks like she's working so hard. These are our new models. I am super happy with them. I'm not sure what to name everybody. Pepsi or Pepto Bisbol. No. <laughs> Well, I already really like the name Huynh because it reminds me of um, Narnia, so maybe I'll find her like a Narnia related name. If you have any ideas, comment below. Xavier? I'll keep her name, I guess, because she's in her box. Indian Pony? I don't know. So yeah, if you guys have any name ideas, drop them down in the comments. Um, yeah, I don't show model horses, so don't think, like I don't have any show names for my models because I've never tried showing them. I'm not sure if any of mine are LSQ or not, um, or PSQ really. I just kind of collect them to display them on my shelf. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and a comment and let me know what you would like to see in the future from me. And stay subscribed for more great Briar videos. So, yeah. See you later. Bye.